Tonight, San Marcos High School is honoring the University of North Texas student who was shot and killed on New Year's Day. Sarah Muchlusher grew up in Martindale and graduated from San Marcos High School in 2013. Early Friday morning in Denton, she was driving her friends home from a party when they got into an argument with a car full of men. Police say one of the men shot and killed Sarah, and now her friends, family, and classmates want to honor her life. KXAN's Heather Jackson is in San Marcos, where preparations are underway. Folks close to her who I've talked with tell me they're still battling with the fact that she's gone. She's not gone. She'll never be gone. As the director of the San Marcos High School Band, Damon Knight taught Sarah for seven years. He saw Sarah grow not only musically, but in her quest for a career in filmmaking. But in the early morning hours on New Year's Day, that journey was cut short. At that moment that she had come to peace with who she's going to be, I think that was the worst. Jenny McGurdy was Sarah's good friend and former classmate at San Marcos High School. She says everyone was so proud of Sarah. People from San Marcos, they, it's hard for us to get out of our small town, but she did. Jenny and her friends organized a candlelight vigil at their old high school to honor Sarah. So we can all come together and do something small, but something big for Sarah one last time. Damon says Sarah will never be forgotten. She's a special kid and a one of those powerful spirits that affects people. In San Marcos, Heather Jackson, KXAN News. The vigil gets underway at 7 o'clock tonight at San Marcos High School. We have a crew there, and we'll show you how they honored Sarah tonight on KXAN News at 9 and 10. The suspect in Sarah's shooting returned to court today. Eric Johnson waived his extradition rights. The Marine was arrested on Tuesday in Yuma, Arizona. Authorities say they found him by tracking social media accounts. It's not clear why Johnson was allegedly in Denton over the weekend. Police say the other people in the car with him are also persons of interest in this case.